Warning, this video is intended for a mature audience. You understand? Viewer discretion is advised. Yay! <laughs> All right, this is Billy Bob Tanley here, people, and this is a request from Cyborg Parrot, and it was uploaded by Brandon Tenmold, and the name of this video is Brandon's Cult Movie Reviews Demon Knight. Okay, let's check it out. Yay. Well, everybody, it's October, and that means one yep. thing. Halloween, Halloween drugs. baby. The greatest right. time of the year for horror movie nerds like me. Now, I'm not a big horror the movie nerd, though. I say that I never know how to do anything special I watched for Halloween, a few, though. since I mostly review monster movies anyway. All right, what are you going to review this, this time? This year, I'm doing something special for Halloween. All right. Tales from the Crypt. I remember this show. It's creepy, man. There's Michael Rosen. What the hell? Tales from the Crypt. That's gross. What are you doing? The shit. Damn, I don't remember all these episodes. But there's some fucked up ones here. Okay. I thought that was Pennywise for a split second. Okay, Brandon Colt Booty. Demon Knight. Here we go with Demon Knight. Ah, uh, yes, Tales from the Crypt. Why didn't you HBO say HBO TV Tales show from the based first. off the classic comic series. I forgot Back it was in the based 90s, this was the show you watched when you wanted gore, nudity, and more horror related puns than anyone thought <laughs> He's a possible. Ball. All right, creeps, it's fourth and ghoul. <laughs> They're probably expecting us to run a ghost pattern, so let's run a Shit. scream pass instead. This was very famous. <laughs> The show was a big hit, lasting seven seasons, so it was only seven? natural that it would Lucky eventually seven. come to the big screen. And so, in oh, 1995, yeah. Tales from the Crypt was, Demon Knight just in time for Halloween uh, January. <laughs> what right. the fuck? Because nothing says scary like the month in between Christmas and well, that's Valentine's bullshit. Day. Shit about Universal Halloween. Studios saying, fuck it, just release it here to horror movies for over 20 years. Hold now, on, let's see. Please, they remember to include the distinctive <laughs> Tales from the Crypt theme music. Damn it, Michael Rosen. What the fuck? Eh, I hate opening credits that have to rely on jump scares. Well, I That's certainly not can't really accuse the movie scare. of not cutting that to the chase. That never scared me. This opening bit manages to cram in pretty much everything the show was known for. Gratuitous nudity, gratuitous gore, and of course, gratuitous Ugh. guest stars. What the hell are you doing? You what? call that acting? <laughs> I do call it acting. Well, He's on the movie set. How? <laughs> the nerd, He's a legend, man. Okay, Crypt Keeper walking is fucking weird looking. He has potential to be a drug lord on YouTube. Uh, John Larroquette's just upset that this movie's not as scary as Beethoven's Fifth. And what did the Crypt Keeper uh, say earlier? I watched earlier? maybe the first and second. Look how short he is. I thought he was well, taller than Maybe you should use Scary Oldman. See, I can do the pun thing too. Okay, we got the Crypt Keeper puns out of the way. Now just hurry up and introduce the movie already, will ya? Well, he's the star, though. The host. Demon Knight. Demon Knight. Well, that's Knight. good. Otherwise, my title card already. wouldn't have made any sense. Wait a second. Billy Zane? William Sadler? Oh, come on, movie. How am I supposed to make fun of you if you actually cast good actors? You're really making well, my job hard actors. here. Sadler and Zane seem to be having a disagreement of some sort, but I got a question got putting it. these two in the same movie. I mean, how am I supposed to tell oh, who's damn, playing the creepy bad now. guy and who's playing the really creepy bad guy? So far, Which, it's looking like Zane has guys? the advantage, since not only does he shrug off getting shot at, but Sadler can apparently be stopped by a awesome. childproof door. What the hell, man? It bullshit. Okay. He exploded. They both died. What was the point of that? And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the most epic costume designer credit you will ever see. Oh, wait, I know why Zane was after him. His hand is really one of the Dragon Balls. He's a demon. Did every producer in Hollywood <laughs> Not work on a Dragon this? Ball. I guess that explains why Dick Miller's in this movie. I'm sure I've Joe Dante's him. name was in there somewhere. Now, if some of you are thinking, wait a second, Dick Miller, where have I seen that guy before? Gremlins? 
The correct answer is fucking everywhere. Oh, yeah, Grimlock's Tomb. Like Grim That's where I remember I think him from. Dick's drinking to forget the fact that he was in Evil Tunes. Never mind that, though. These two need to find a place to stay. Is that where we're going? No homo. It's like a church. <laughs> Lightning. This be a church. Well, that's great. After Bill gets in there, he's going to take control of an airport. I feel like I'm having a flashback. Take him to South Deja America. vu. Well, it looks like these two came to the right place. The okay, only other people movie. in here are other character actors. I'm serious. This movie has so many character actors. All it needs is Bruce Campbell and Ken Forey. And it's pretty much every horror movie convention Bring I've ever in. been to. For Give example, call. veterans of the show may recognize Brenda Bakke, who was in Gunhead. There's also Gun Jada Pinkett Smith, before she got smithed, and Peaches from the Shield. Is that Will Smith's wife? Point, I wouldn't be surprised if Roger Rabbit showed up. Postmaster comes in. Boys, that's Roger Rabbit? Really Don't look like him. Right off my shirt. Right Don't even sound like him. him. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised <laughs> if Christopher Walken showed up. Of course no, not. That was worth a shot. Oh, and in case you didn't know Brenda's character was a prostitute. Are my sheets done yet? They're downstairs. And I couldn't get all Is that really Will Smith's wife? Ex wife, whatever? She got some teeth. Well, nice to know I'm not the only guy out there with green semen. Uh, green semen. Oh, poor guy. Hey, maybe I should give him a freebie. Hmm, just what he needs. Uh, no, it just doesn't happen like yeah, that. Cordelia, the poor guy just lost his job. The last thing he needs right now it's is creepy a beautiful looking. woman that he obviously has a crush on having sex with him. Well, this that is doesn't happen, on. folks. Same gets picked up by the that doesn't happen. Justice twins here and gets Unless you got Savage billions of dollars, trail. you can get any woman you want. I wasn't really watching the speedometer. Exactly why were you chasing me? Son of a bitch thought he could get Cow to be the boy. Phantom. Boy, I hope he's not like from Ram all Ranch. Producers didn't help the Ram Ranch has gave a bad reputation much. to all the and cowboys that's again, normal. In case you didn't know Cordelia is a prostitute yet. You hurry up and finish it. I wouldn't think she was. I'd just I be thinking think she's a hot know. woman. Tissue dessert. getting all slutty and shit. Mm, I don't think tuna counts as a dessert. What? I don't right, know. I just let the that. movie supply the vagina Coyote. jokes then. God damn it. Get that pussy off the table. <laughs> I meant the cat. No, you didn't. Well, we're almost Black there, cats but I think this place look. Can use one more character actor. Hey, Thomas Aiden Church. Thank you, Marie. Huh. Zane and the cops make it to the boarding house. See, he must be a bounty that Sadler hunter. may not be who he says he is. Drop the guns, drop the guns. I said drop your goddamn guns! What the hell, man? What the fuck? Sheriff, and he absolutely will not do it. Put a cork in it, Zane. Ah, oh, come what, on. What you knew I had to use that clip at some point. I didn't get it. Well, oh no, they're gonna bend him over and Mr. do something. Breaker. Pleased to make your acquaintance. You know, Sadler should really be grateful the cops are just cuffing him. Usually movies end with him getting blown up. Keep away from me! Shut up! <laughs> you know what? Maybe instead of put a cork in it, Zane, I should just use that clip. Keep away from me! Shut up! I'll Shut up. harm you! You know, law enforcement in this town really hasn't been the same your since Your gun Lost sucks. Had to take Look at Roscoe's mine compared to yours. Sheriff. And here's another fun fact. Back in the days before Viagra, if you had erectile dysfunction, you had to jumpstart your cock with a car battery. <laughs> what the yeah, fuck? Are smoking. I'm sure the officer will handle this <laughs> okay, situation. Okay, that does not happen at all. I am assuming it was personal business, Cordelia. Actually, sure. Cordelia. Sounds like Cornelius the Catalog's cock. Tune up and a lube job. Mm, I think I like my joke better. Eventually, the cops find Breaker's key thingy that Zane's after, so. He's got demonic I powers this and shit. Zane wins? See, both those cars well, I feel like I've seen this clip a long time ago. This shit out. Sheriff, you're making a big mistake. Well, you can't blame the guy for being thorough. I mean, both of you do usually play bad guys. Then again, they both maybe killed right. earlier? Why wait? Welcome. Oh shit! Yep, definitely not human. Hey, come on, Billy. The Crypt Keeper's supposed to do the puns. He makes that very clear in his contract. That they both fight each other. I can't stay mad at you. Humans, you're not worth the flesh you're printed on. Fuck this cowboy shit. What the hell? Well, they and their motherfuckers. All right, can I just say shit, something? Man. I fucking love Billy Zane in this movie. I mean, come on, on, just cocaine. look at him. The guy was born to play charming yet creepy bad guys. There's a smile that says, uh -uh. Nice to meet you. Now you need to fucking die. This Kill him. Is hereby condemned. So Zane uses his hand guacamole to create He's a bunch of pumpkin wood. head rejects. Here's hoping it's the first pumpkin head who then pumpkin attacked head. the building. Oh yeah, I remember that movie. I've watched both Where of them. 
goes, they win. Ah, don't worry, they're just hiding that behind creepy. that jump scare. I'm getting creepy vibes from him. See? Told you. <laughs> Breaker informs everyone that the only way to defeat the demons is to shoot them in That's the eyes. That's not demons, That's it's not zombies. That's strategy, since this apparently lets them shoot you back. <laughs> okay. The zombies with green powers. I sure showed him. Ugh. Breaker also seals up the place with his key thingy, but even that can't keep out Zane's one-liners. Peter Ham. The shield. Breaker for crying out loud. Hey, don't worry, Billy. In a couple of years, you'll get to be in Titanic, and Sadler will have to be in Rocket Man. I thought I recognized him from Top Ten. Well, it is what the title says. Although for a second there, it looks like I put in Tales from the Crypt: Life of Brian. With nowhere else to go, looks like it's up to Breaker to earn the others' trust. All right, what are you gonna do? I wasn't gonna hurt you. Funny thing is, is that I knew you were. Keep your wife's dick out Well, it's nice to know you have good intuition regarding guys with a knife to your throat saying they're going to kill you. Meanwhile, looks like these two are having a bit of a lover's spat. Good morning, you bitch. Oh, you know, I'm not afraid of you. No? No. <laughs> Oh, now, come on, man. What the hell is wrong with you? Guy, but he's actually just auditioning to be a superhero in a Turkish movie. <laughs> uh, poor Cordelia. Maybe Zane can make her feel better. Poor Cordelia. She's gonna die. Seems downright criminal. And you, what, shut the fucking idea. curtain. I understand you. I You're a demon you. bitch. I know what you need. Put a cork in it, Zane. All you have to do is... Zoolander, is that the name of that movie? Let me in. And I guess the smooth talking works since Cordelia does decide to let him in. Oh well, right, I suppose well, this would be mistake. the first time she's let a creepy guy come inside her. What? <laughs> what do I keep saying? <laughs> and I don't think Jessica would appreciate the fact that Roger is about to cheat on her. You really love me, don't you, Wally? I've always loved you. From Creep. The first time that I delivered you. He looks like a murderer. Yeah, nice one, Wally. An axe murderer. Next, tell her about the wall in your apartment that's covered in black and white pictures of her. Unfortunately for Wally, he won't get to play patty cake with Cordelia. I wouldn't be too upset though. She looks well, a lot well, different without the her hell makeup. Happened to her? I'm also starting She's to question exorcist? this movie's commitment. For example, Irene gets Come her on, arm man. ripped off, and the movie Couldn't doesn't she at do least a survive? single give her a hand pun. Are you a <laughs> Tales from the Crypt movie or not? It's nasty. All of you. You don't know what you're up against. I have seen this, doing a real fine job but very few clips yeah, of it when it was on TV. Yeah, dressing up like Danzig isn't helping things either, Roach. The characters Just try to so escape through an abandoned mind mineshaft, but unfortunately for them, it contains something that. even worse than demons. Extraneous child characters. Wow. Normally this type of thing would piss me off, but considering I haven't reviewed a Gamera movie yet... I better save some Confusing. of my obnoxious kid hate for later. Holy shit, man, I'm getting scared. Run, the mine chef was just a ruse to pad out the movie's length. Run! <laughs> this is for four years of minimum wage, you asshole. No! Idiot. You broke the seal! Broke the seal? Wait, 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 let me get this straight. So the key thing, he protects them from the demons, unless they kill the demons, in which case the key's protection doesn't I don't get work it, anymore? Man. Who's that? How does that work? God damn it, I'm not making these rules up! Really? Yeah, you Because it kind of seems like you are. <laughs> you wanna know what's going on? Well, we're an hour oh, in, yeah, I have so seen this guy yeah, it'd be somewhere. nice. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Just tell us what's happening and go push your religion on somebody else, okay? <laughs> so it turns out Breaker no is actually up. the latest in the line of people chosen to protect a sacred key. If the demons get their hands on the key, it'll cause the end of the world. And the reason the key is so special is because... Now to save it, God filled it with the blood of a carpenter. A carpenter? Who's being crucified by the Romans. So the key is full of Jesus' blood. Well, at least that means if they get thirsty, they'll have a steady supply of red wine. Or great what juice for the kid. Okay. Now you know. You feel better? No, I don't feel better. It's bad enough you cast actors that I like, but now you've actually got an interesting story, too? You're really screwing me here, movie. Fuck you. Get some balls, man. You're all gonna die. You're a fucking hero. Yeah, there might be a more hero with terrible peripheral vision. The kid runs off because splitting up the characters was probably the only Dumbest reason he was written in this movie ever. in the first place. Never and split Zane up. tries to seduce Geraldine, apparently by putting her in a salt and pepper video. There's a great big world out there, Geraldine. You should travel. You can see it all. I can help you. 
Who's out that guy talking? Rome, Athens, you got it. Yeah, you say that now, but you'll actually just end up going to Madagascar over and over again. Oh, what? I didn't get that. Is say yes. Do we have a deal? <laughs> put the hell? They just spit out his face. Well, Zane couldn't bring Geraldine over to just the dark side. Let's give Uncle on. Willie a try. Fortunately, this time he's armed with something a little more persuasive. An R rating. Poor Uncle Willie. You don't see this. Oh my these are these women are on different planets. I hate to break it to you, ladies, but I don't think Uncle Willie's had a long, hard one since the Howling. <laughs> also, this is a Tales from the Crypt movie. You're supposed to be making Halloween puns, not cock innuendos. Speaking of Halloween, I think that. Zane decided to dress up like Hunter S. Thompson. Shut <laughs> this one down, Uncle Willie. Long, hard one. Nothing it's weird. Am I right, guys? Mm, I think the real Hunter S. Thompson could probably name a few things that get you fucked up faster, but uh, it seems to have been effective. Okay, so he's transformed. Right Here's a little known fact about demonic possession. Not only are you able to still be alive after getting your head chopped off, but it also turns you into a completely different person. Oh, what? Well, and you the look kid's like a different person when your skin gets too? all fucked Cut up. Cut me some slack, movie. I'm trying to find things to nitpick here. Ow. In other news, plot convenience. Okay. Hey, Bob. Oh, That's some nice guns. He was planning to take out the post office for Cadelia. Ah, the 90s. A time when you could depend on any postal worker to be a gun crazy nutcase. And I know well, I keep using got this more and gun. Clip, but Maybe I should get I it actually more. actually want to hear him talk more. I don't know you ain't gonna kill me. You have my word. Of course, you don't mind if we kill the others, do you? Thanks. <laughs> It makes you feel good. I know dude. who you are now. Feel good, do it. And if you what need a hell? paycheck, just Sam keep man, isn't it? Oh, and here's a shocker. Apparently, From the Spider devil man is untrustworthy. Three. Oh, Roach, there's just one more thing I forgot to mention. I lied. Uh, of course. Poor Roach. He didn't deserve to die. Oh, wait, yes, he did. Well, I yeah, guess this right, means left to lose some life. She didn't deserve to die, to though. It out. What the fuck? Time. Where'd you get that? <laughs> Everybody just died um, left and right. Zing. Normally, at this point in a horror movie, I'd be angry that the kid is still around, but actually, he really hasn't been annoying or obtrusive to the movie at all. Not only that, but later on, first. when the kid gets possessed and turns into a monster, oh, the movie God. actually has the balls to kill him, too, which is something wow. you don't really see that much. You take no, a note, so Hollywood. Today. <laughs> Hollywood doesn't know how to do things right anymore. Ricker shouldn't be surprised that he dies at the end of this. I mean, he is played by Bill Sadler. The only way this could be die? more inevitable is if he were played she's by gonna Sean. Bean. So Breaker transfers the key over to Geraldine, and Zane has apparently decided to be Joe Satriani for Halloween now. Geraldine tries fending him off with the blood of Christ, but Zane's armed with the power of puns. It's curtains for you, baby! Also, curtains. if the key burned him before, just how is he able to touch it now? Well, I'm sure it's in the rules somewhere. Damn. Guess Breaker didn't have time to tell you everything, huh? That eyeball shit only works on low level. Man, kill him already, I know. Who makes up all these rules? I don't know, these guys? Oh boy, dragging a girl covered in blood wrapped in a shower curtain. Okay, yeah, she definitely did. I've been there before. So having seemingly won, Zane okay, decides to put on one last charm offensive. I want you. You know, no one's ever brought a demon knight over the other side before. Title drop. I hate you. you notice you're not saying anything. Hmm? Do you something to say? What the hell is there to think about? Well, jokes for Punch one. Him. For example, you might want to get that gonorrhea checked out there, Billy. No more! <laughs> and his name's Billy, come on! Jolene, I'm gonna say something to you. I haven't said to, to anyone. I don't regret doing Scorpion King 3. Alright, time oh, yeah, to put a stop some Scorpion this King. And I think yeah. you know where this is. Not Scorpion is King, but the mummy. Damn it. I'm gonna take your heart. Oh, shit. Put a cork in it, Zane. And so, oh. having been defeated, Zane reenacts the ending to Evil Dead. Oh, I'm sorry, I meant Hellraiser. Did he become a demon for a second? And that's Tales from the Crypt Demon... Uh, huh? Oh, right, I forgot he, about No, he paid her billions. I love Scarnations. <laughs> I'm afraid I've got to hurry. 
Tonight's you get anybody, me. folks, if you're making the millions yeah, and shit. Pun, 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 pun. Just wrap it up, will ya? Uh-oh. Hollywood star. I think my producers are trying to tell me something. I don't know what the hell the producers are upset about. This is easily the best one of this series. No, really, I mean it. In fact, I actually think this movie's kind of underrated. He did I mean, it won't killed. go as far he as to call die. it a horror classic or anything, but in terms of just being a fun horror comedy and a good representation of what the TV show was It's a strange-ass movie. I think this movie largely succeeds. The story is actually pretty interesting. It has a sense of humor while still remembering the entire that it's a horror movie, and the movie's well-made and entertaining. It also helps yeah, that it's got a goofy. great cast, and the actors are clearly having fun with their roles. You fucking hold dunk, hold dunk, well then there, motherfuckers! So if you're looking for a fun movie to watch this Halloween, <laughs> Demon gross. Knight gets my recommendation. Just don't eat watch it. Well, that's all for now, but the Tales from Demon the Crypton has just begun. I hope you enjoyed this one. Okay, so you got more? Because it's all downhill from here. Oh, no. So there you go, everyone. If y'all want to watch the original video, the link is in the description. Go check it out and shit. I'm getting the fuck out here, so yeah. My name is Billy Bob Tanley, and I approve this message.